Hey, welcome back to the stream. Um, I'm back from the fucking dead, basically. Okay. Um, I was very sniffly, snotty girl the past couple of days, and the last time I streamed, someone was like, "Can you blow your nose?" And that that was enough for me to take a couple days off. Anyways, um, I just posted a new part, like, just posted it, so most people probably didn't see it, but the Christmas party just happened, y'all. As you can see, Father Winter is still here. Oh, y'all didn't open your presents. Y'all did not even open your presents. Now, I paid good money for these hoes. Y'all better come over here. Um, everybody better open some fucking presents today. It's 1.30 in the morning there. Oh my goodness. Um, but yeah, the Christmas party just happened. If you have to go back and watch the other episode that I just posted, I understand. Um, the first, like, ten minutes, you're not going to miss anything. Hopefully, not going to miss anything imperative right now. But the Christmas party is basically wrapping up. Most of everybody went home. Father Winter is still lingering around. He's kind of got the hots for Doris. Which, I mean, everybody's got the hots for Doris. And if you didn't watch the last part, I'm about to spoil something for you, but Doris is freaking pregnant, okay? Doris is pregnant. She has not been pregnant since Farkley. And might I add, Farkley got engaged this evening to Shrek Hunzel. So she could be a grandma any day now, and she gets pregnant. So we are going to be having a baby shower for Doris today in this live um we might get to have her baby today in the live not sure but we will definitely be having a baby shower actually let's go ahead and plan the baby shower now oh hell doris ages up next monday so if my calculations are correct doris should be having her baby one two three saturday night ish so i think probably tomorrow in the game um we should be able to have her baby shower or maybe friday should we do tomorrow or friday mm, tomorrow we'll go ahead and have her baby shower um the expecting parent would be doris none of these people are expecting and then who all are we going to invite to this uh baby shower let's do Huh. Anna can come. Obviously, Doris is coming. Elsa, you're not coming. The Muffin Man, you are not coming. Shrekira can come. Farquette can come. Farquifa is going. We gotta b bring baby snow shit. Um, Shrekunzel, Sparkplug. Rapunzel. Mmm, Nyla Boon. Snow White, Sleeping Beauty, and that's it. That would go to her baby shower. Also today, yes, it'll be uploaded to YouTube. Also today, we are going to be um, looking for a new house for Doris because since she's expecting, I just feel like she should probably get her own place. Like it's probably like Doris has been in the in the building, I think longer than most people thank you shambles for the love you um what is this the recreation center i guess we'll have it there but we'll have it there tomorrow at like 6 p.m that'll be cute anyways so we have doris's baby shower planned who's her baby daddy i would assume it's grim's baby i would assume now if it's not then, oh, girl over here rubbing your belly. Also, we're gonna have to go get an ultrasound done. We need to hire, okay, first things first. We need to hire her a realtor. Um, how do I hire a realtor? Let me try to figure it out really quick. Cause I know, hmm. I'm trying to remember. Okay, hire a realtor. So we need to hire somebody if we would like to move out at some point. And Renee said, BRV, gotta go watch the new thing. Thank you, Kayla, for the roses. 
Um, so we have some different realtor options here. We have Braylon Meredith. Um, his commission is 2.25%. He has 20 years of experience and four stars. Um, this lady has five stars. Her commission is twice as much. Um, 15 years. Ooh, she's got one star. Hell no. One star, no. He's got four stars. Five stars, but... Uh-uh. Ooh, this girl has five stars, but her commission rate is only 2%. Shayna? I think we should hire her as our realtor. It says full name, Shayna Peralta. Five-star rating, commission is 2.7%. Shayna has six years of experience in the field. Are you sure you want to hire her as your realtor? Are we selling the swamp no but doris is going to be getting her own place um like some of the other people in the series have shrek is still going to be at his swamp but since doris is expanding uh the family and whatever we need to start looking elsewhere for places to live so it says congratulations you just hired shayna as your realtor um sure uh, it says a realtor will help you buy, sell, or rent out a property. They will be of service across all your blah, 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 blah. Great. Excellent. So glad we have a realtor now. Um, they've all been opening their little presents and whatever. If someone doesn't fix this freaking sink, good lord, y'all done walked in and out of this bathroom about ten times, and no one's, like, taking it upon themselves to fix the sink. You know who can fix it now? Shrek Hunzel. I don't know why I'm the most mad at her, but I am. Actually, I know exactly why I'm mad. Because you ate, you tore up Christmas dinner before anybody got here for the party. And that, I just don't understand. Um, don't mind me just cleaning up all of their messes. These children, basically. Okay, so it's 1.03 a.m. I'm gonna get Doris to go to sleep really quick. Because, you know, she is a pregnant, uh lady now shana said thanks for hiring me as your realtor thank you girl um not doris immediately going to sleep so shrek is looking at shrekunzel fix the sink instead of like helping her he's just like staring at her smiling love that for her um snow shit is all up in she's tearing shit up snow shit stop it she's a terrible baby you know what while i'm thinking of it shrek you should probably go ahead and make a cake for your daughter so we can age her up again i keep forgetting that she's a little girl and she's not supposed to be um let's go ahead and make her another chocolate cake so we can age her up again and then in the morning we gotta go for a little doctor's appointment so shit, why are you crying to Doris? That's not your mom. I love how she literally treats Doris like her mom now. Doris, don't piss yourself, girl. Oh my lord. Honestly, isn't it kind of bizarre though that everybody's acting like Doris didn't kill Granny Wolf? Like she had a full on like violent moment and nobody is acting weird about it. Also, her little tombstone's outside, and I have not seen her ghost one time. She is mad. She is staying in there. She has not come to, she, even on Christmas, she didn't come visit anybody. I'm gonna go ahead and delete, uh, this stuff. Since nobody wanted to use it at the party. And I guess I can delete the Christmas tree, too. Do, 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 do. There's some other Christmas decorations up here and there too, but it's fine. Um, Doris, what's up with all of them taking little naked shits? I don't understand. Let's see. Okay, the birthday cake is done. Let's go ahead and add the rules with these cakes are so stupid. Let's go ahead and add some birthday candles so we can hopefully get snow shit aged up. 
Why is he naked? Oh, no, he's not naked. He's just going for a little, a little swim. Also, Shrek, I would not be going swimming out here in a freezing fart pond because you're going to end up dead next. And you know what I'm going to be able to do? Nothing. Absolutely nothing. Shake said hello, queen. Hey. Thank you for sharing the live. What about the Muffin Man? Does Dor does he know Doris did him dirty? I have no idea if he knows or not. He looked a little sad leaving uh, the function. So, oh, not poison food. Not the, <laughs> not the baby thinking about poisoning the food, girl. With her little stinky butt. Stop crying to everybody. I need somebody to age her up immediately. Immediately. Snow shit wandering away in the snow. What will the new baby's name be? I have no idea. I do not know yet. We will find out when the baby... I don't even know if the baby's a boy or girl yet. We gotta um go to her ultrasound and find out. Look at Shrek carrying snow shit inside. Which, snow shit is Shrek's daughter. Like, I kind of forget it. It feels like... um. Doris is her mom, but she's not. Snow White is, but Snow White is never around, so. Who's pregnant? Freaking Doris is pregnant. Here goes Snow Shit, aging up again. So, for her trait, um, I don't remember what they were before. I'm gonna make her an art lover. That seems good. And we'll just do... And Snow Shit is a kid now. So she's one step uh, closer. What do you use to unzip your files? On my computer, I can just like right click on them and click extract. And I don't have an actual, unless my computer just came with a program that I'm not aware of, I didn't download anything specific to be able to extract my files. Wasn't she an adult before? Yes, she was. <laughs> and now she's having to go from the beginning back up. But don't worry, we're slowly getting her age back up. She'll be fine. I'm not worried about her. Uh, I'm going to fast forward a little bit. And then Doris. I think we should go stop at the coffee shop really quick before she goes in for her ultrasound. So let's go get uh, a little coffee, shall we? Before we do anything. I don't even know where all of my coffee shops are, but I know there's one. The hair and the hedgehog. That sounds adorable. So let's go. Let's invite Shrekira to go with her because I think she just needs like someone kind of level-headed to to talk to right now. Alyssa said, "Hey." I think she should go on another date with the Muffin Man. They're literally together. Like, he's her boyfriend, officially. So she's together with the Muffin Man. Like, he was asking us if, um, if we wanted to live together. And she was like, no, I don't want to live with you yet. But they're literally in a committed relationship right now. Um, she is pregnant. We'll do whatever the barista recommends for pregnant people. Shrekira, you look very lovely today. Anyways, so she's literally dating the Muffin Man, and then he wanted us to move in together, and she was like, no, but she still wanted to date him. But it's just all around awkward as hell, because now she's pregnant with, I'm pretty sure, the Grim Reaper's baby, and she was just hitting on Daddy Winter. Girl, what are you reading over here? Shrekira is so underrated. Nobody ever talks about Shrekira. She really just minds her business. She's so grown. It says this one's a little, uh, sir? Um, anyways. Here, it's a Cafe Zorro. Okay, sounds good to me. So Doris is about to drink her little coffee. Um, Doris is not ready for the commitment. No, literally, she's not. Not her stirring her little her little coffee up. Go ahead and drink it. Um, it's 542 in the morning. Also, since it was Winterfest yesterday, look how it's like been snowing outside. 
and it's kind of like still quiet outside in the morning all the little houses with the snow on top of them that's so cute that's so cute i love snow i live in south carolina though so i don't have to actually deal with snow so i can i can be like oh i love snow he 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 just like people that don't have kids that are like yeah i just love little kids and they have like no empathy whenever a parent is just like just trying to vent and they're like <gasps> that's how i am about snow anyways um i guess since she's wrapped up can we, actually let's talk to shrekira a little bit before we just leave let's go share the big news with shrekira um let's see what she says about this She's like, really? That's great. That oh, don't tell her a dirty joke. Plus, I'm pretty sure Shakira is related to Doris. Yeah, that's your granddaughter, girl. Don't be weird. Do not be weird. Um, friendly. Is there anything else we can tell her about? Let's discuss how we're expanding the family. Do all of these uh, worlds cost extra? Yeah, so you get the um, you get the pack or get the worlds whenever you buy other packs. It says, "I'm glad you brought this up, Doris. I've been thinking the same. Let me ponder on that thought for a short while, and I'll get back to you." Oh, she thinks we're talking about her having another baby, Shakira. We're not worried about. We are not worried about you having another baby, which I have to. Let me look at the family tree. Who did Shakira have her kids with? Oh yeah. Bajorn, I forgot. Shrekira, that's why she's not married. Oh, it's all coming together for me right now. It's all coming together for me. Shrekira had an affair with Bajorn, and then she had her twins, Farquet and Fart Pond. I'm back on the right track now. All right. Well, um... I've always wondered what mods you use. I use MC Command Center. Uh, I use the Realistic Birth Mod by Panda Sama. Um, UI Cheats. I use Base Mental, and I use the Extreme Violence mod. And sometimes I'll add in other ones and whatnot. Like, I'm using a real estate one today. Oh, speaking of which, we need to call our realtor before we go to our appointment. Thank you for reminding me. Okay, open realtor profile. No, it's not what I wanted to do. Um, we need to make an appointment with our realtor. Or we could rent a property, but I think that she should buy a house. She's grown. She got great, 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 great grandkids and shit. We should, uh, we should be able to buy a house. So we're going to go ahead and call and schedule an appointment. Oh, wait, she's going to want to have the appointment right this second. Okay, I guess we're going to have an appointment with our realtor before we go to the OB. It says, greetings, Miss Shrek. First of all, we're not Miss Shrek. We're Miss Doris. Um, I've already separated some of our current most valuable listings for you to consider. Our appointment is scheduled for the next hour. Oh, Lord. Today's going to drain me because why the hell? Not Jeffrey Landgrab over here in a llama sweater. Anyways. Aw, that's so cute that she was just rubbing her belly. I'm not gonna lie. For her first trimester, she's got... Her bump is bumping. Bumping. Another swamp? No. So, I think that Doris is more so looking for, like, a cottage or a house. Something more Doris-like. You know, Doris is all in on her family all the time. And you know what? It's her turn to worry about her, okay? And I think she proved that whenever she took Granny out, but Doris is not for the mud and the slime for real. Devin thinks she's having twins. I don't know, we'll find out at the OB appointment. Oh, 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 girl, that is so embarrassing for you. Yikes. Anyway, so how, is our realtor coming here? Is, is the realtor coming to meet us here, or do we need to, um, what's happening? It says your realtor has arrived. 
Why is everyone in our house here now? It says during the appointment you can do all these things. That's great, but why did everyone in our house show up? There's the realtor. Um, the rest of y'all can go home. Uh, I guess they all have to be here for this appointment because they're technically in our household. Anyways, let's go ahead, uh, go do a little friendly introduction with our realtor. Real quick. She looks nice. Shayna looks very nice, very cute. Thank you, Shay, for the heart me. Um, is this gonna be on YouTube? Yes. Literally, the whole family pulled up. She's like, "Hi, I'm Doris." Um, Shayna, we'll go ahead and set our house wish list. I I have an idea. I have an idea of like what I want her house to be like, so hopefully we can find that. What's her face came back to life? Yes. So spark plug is back. She made a wish in the wishing well. Our house value range, it could be anywhere from 10k to I'm gonna say I'll set a 400. Mm, we'll do half a million. I want our range to be really large. So, we are not going to be skimping on our house for Doris. I can I can pull out the moolah for her. And then the worlds that we'll be looking in, um, there's different percentages for different ones. Obviously, Windenburg is a very hot spot. Everybody likes living there. Um, Strangerville and Forgotten Hollow are negative percentages because who the hell wants to live there as a normal sim? Moonwood Mill is another one that is a lot cheaper to live in um so we're going to be okay with glimmerbrook because that's where they live right now hemford on bagley i would be open to sulani uh and maybe like windenburg that's where she's at right now is windenburg so this brings me so much serotonin i'm glad okay so we have our worlds and then the lots We'll say any traits are fine. So we'll go ahead and submit that. She said, thank you, Miss Shrek. That was very helpful. I'll contact you in the next 24 hours with the best house listings. So I guess that's like kind of everything we need to do during this appointment. Um, yeah, let's go ahead and end the appointment with her so we can go ahead and go to our, uh, so we can go to our OB appointment. We got a lot of appointments today. Thank you, Greta, for the donut. She said, it was a pleasure speaking with you, Miss Shrek. I'll start working right away to make sure you get the best deals. Looking forward to our next meeting. Awesome. Ugh, not her son. Farkley just texted us. He said, I heard you and the Muffin Man started dating. Congratulations on the new boyfriend. Shut up, Farkley. Um, let's go ahead and go to our OB appointment. And then we do need to go ahead and start thinking about a couple things as far as her delivery. Thank you, Beebs, for the rose. So there's a few different birthing options. We can go through the surgery machine, we can have a natural delivery, we can schedule a C-section, or we can try to have a home birth. So those are gonna be our options. We will have to pick one at some point, um, but let's go ahead and go in for a pregnancy checkup. Thank you, Shanna, for the rose. Um, who are we gonna bring with her? Should we bring the muffin man? Or should we bring uh? Oh, it's not even an option to bring the Grim Reaper. Hmm. Maybe we should bring Farquette or Farkley. She could bring her son with her. Thank you for all the roses, Shanna. Um, not Farkley hurts. She's trying to move in the house and or trying to get a house, and he's trying to move in too. Um, I guess we're gonna bring the Muffin Man since her baby daddy isn't available. That's so awkward. What if he asked for a paternity test? That'd be so awkward. Ugh. I hope he's not mad at us for hitting on Father Winter on Christmas. Oh, girl, don't piss yourself. Let me help you out here. Let me just help you out here. Um. Oh, Mohawk Doctor! Oh! <gasps> the Muffin Man left! Damn it, he had shit to do. All right, that's fine. Um, let's go ahead and go get our blood work done first. Obviously, we want Mohawk Doctor to do it. Thank you, Stargirl, for the roses. And thank you, Libby, for the gamepad. 
Um, we're gonna go get our blood work done first, just to get that out of the way before we have to deal with... Girl, what the hell is this outfit? What is this? But just to go ahead and get it out of the way, I'm so glad we have a uh, Mohawk doctor here. He's probably like, so what's been going on with Snow shit lately? I haven't heard, she hasn't texted me back. And she's probably like, you know, um, she turned into a baby and we're working on trying to get her aged up again. What is the stain on her shirt? I think that's just the color pattern. It says, we will get your results back tomorrow. Don't worry too much. If there's any issues or concerns, we'll make sure to get in touch with you. Let's go ahead and get her pap smear. Now, I will say a pap smear goes crazy in this game. I mean, the first time I saw it, I was like, ugh, you gross. Is she pregnant? Yes, she's pregnant. Um, she got pregnant a couple episodes ago, but she just finally took her pregnancy test. So, anyways, she's got to have a little pap smear done real quick before we get our ultrasound done. I'm going to just do it from this angle back here because it's a lot going on down going on down there like look at her uh-uh couldn't be me could not be me uh-uh i gotta i can't even look at it i can't even look uh uh poor doris anyways after she gets done with that we're gonna start our ultrasound scan with mohawk doctor granny was backstabbed by her beloved doris yes literally granny had been going around killing so many people and i guess like doris was sick of it and she just like lost it one day are you about done down there sir jesus christ taking forever oh also y'all don't let me forget um granny got somebody pregnant before she died she has twins on the way i don't know if they've already been born hmm I don't even remember who her baby mama is. We gotta go find her. We gotta find Granny's babies. They're somewhere. But let's get this ultrasound done first. Oh yeah, Miko. Miko was the baby mama. We gotta find Miko, y'all. We have got to find Miko before those twins are born. Oh yeah, because technically it's a male wolf. Yeah. Granny Wolf was very problematic. <gasps> oh my god, y'all! Do y'all see what this says? You probably can't see what it says, because, uh, uh, I was about to say Twitch. TikTok is shit, but it says, congratulations, you're expecting twins! <gasps> the ultrasound scan shows that you have two healthy babies growing inside of you. Um, this is a big change. Hold on, I have to pause this. I don't want to miss anything. It says, this is a big change, but we'll be here to support you every step of the way. It's important to take care of yourself and your baby, so be sure to get enough rest, eat a healthy diet, and stay hydrated. This is an exciting and busy uh, time, but with proper care and support, you'll be able to have a healthy pregnancy and delivery. Oh. <gasps> one is a girl and one is a boy. It says you're having a healthy baby girl, and it says the second baby appears to be a boy. Yeah, no wonder her bump is bumping. Oh my god, Doris. She's having twins. And you know what's crazy is technically Granny Wolf has twins on the way too because Miko is pregnant with twins. Where is Miko? I don't even know how to go about finding Miko. You know what? Let's go where we met Miko last time. Let's go to the poison apple. What did we meet her at the um did we meet her at the poison apple? I don't remember, but let's go over there. You know, we don't mind going to the poison apple to begin with. I always have to remember where the hell I put the poison apple. Is it in Windenburg, maybe? Yeah. Let's actually let's go to the Muffin Man's place. Since he wanted to fucking disappear on us, let's go see what he's doing at work, if he's so damn busy. Um, see, I always forget where things are. Let's see. I think it's in Henford on Bagley. Yes. So let's go see what he's doing, since he was so busy earlier. Had to leave the... We're expecting twins, Muffin Man. You wanted to live with us? You can't even come to our freaking... Um, Ultrasound? I can't believe she's having twins. Oh my god. Oh my god. 
It was Granny's Diner. Grismelda. Um, so let's go ahead and Roman. Oh, don't propose to him. Let's go ahead and uh, give him a hug. I love this little place, though. It is so cute in here. Also, I'm going to put her in her winter wear really quick because I do not want anybody else dying. Especially when we got a little baby on the way. Or two babies on the way. Um, let's discuss interests. And then I think we should talk about marriage because, you know, she couldn't even get Grim. She couldn't even find his number to call him to come to the thing. And, you know, she's thinking about buying a house now. And you know she wants to settle down. Like, obviously, she wanted to date him for a reason. Why does it say he's very angry? Huh. Weird. Why is he yelling at us? Is he mad because we were hitting on Father Winter? Is that what this is about? Over here, upset. Look at him. He looks pissed right now. What is his problem? Literally, we do not need this energy. He's angry because she's pregnant and the baby isn't his. He does not know that. How would he know? Let's, um... Hobbies, deep thoughts. Yeah, let's ask him to accompany us with this childbirth and see what he says. Thank you, Livy, for the confetti, and thank you, Shanna, for the gamepad. Let's see what he says. He See, he said yes. I knew he would want it. He said, I'm glad you asked. I will be there for you. Of course he will. Why is he yelling, though? I don't know why he's so damn angry. Can we try to calm him down? Thank you, Evie, for the big love, and Greta for the big loves. Ugh, stop yelling. Ew, Doris, I don't know if we want him there for the childbirth. I do not like how he's freaking... Can you do a paternity test on them? Yes, once they're born, we can. What do Grimm's kids come out as? I don't even know. Thank you, Layla, for the rose. Um, And Chantel for the gamepad. Let's apologize to him, I guess. Actually, no, we're not apologizing to him. We will... Uh, uh, a pregnancy cuddle? That sounds so cute. Actually, we're not doing that right this second. Um, Let's try to cheer him up, I guess. Ew, I do not like... This is a type of dude that calls women kitten and punches walls. Thank you, Harry Toes. <laughs> Can she marry someone else? No, literally. Why is he acting like this? No, we are not apologizing to him. Talk about the snow. Talk about the snow. Yeah, now he's acting all fine. Also, Agnes Crumplebottom is in here. I'm not trying to get crumple bottom by her. Let's, um... I'm pretty sure if we're romantic with uh, the Muffin Man in here, she will be rude as shit to us. Like, watch. See how she's just, like, angry walking around? You know who wouldn't act like this at the childbirth? Granny Wolf. No, literally. I can't believe Granny Wolf freaking... Ugh. Uh, I can't believe that she got taken out like that. Thank you, Harry Toes. See, look at how she's over there acting. She's mad as hell. But you know what? This is her man. This is her man. So, <gasps> we could propose to him, but absolutely not. He's gonna have to, um, propose to us, obviously. But I think it's cute that she came up here to see her man. She came up here to see her man at his little establishment and whatever. Um... Now, Agnes, you better not play with us because we've killed a lady. Oh, hell no. Now, Agnes don't fucked up. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. Because ain't no way you're about to hit us, hit us like that. Ain't no way. Ain't no fucking way you're about to play Doris like that, Agnes. No. And she thought what? And you thought what? You thought you were about to beat us with your purse and we weren't going to do nothing? You thought we were about to just take that shit? And our man's watching. And we're pregnant with twins. Girl, don't you ever fuck with me like that again. Get over it. Yeah. Crumple bottom. Crinkle fry. 
better go on somewhere else. And don't you ever hit me with that damn purse again, bitch. Anyways. <laughs> He's just over here smiling. Um, let's go ahead and talk about marriage. Thank you, Alien K. Not Doris just smiling. She does not care. She does not care. What's the Muffin Man crying? Who the hell is this? Oh, not Pinocchio's dad being the one at the bar. What's his name again? Geppetto? Is that how you say it? Is that how you freaking say it? Thank you, Alien K. Where's your son at? Where's, uh... Where's the little, um, Pinocchio at? You know what? I don't even care right now. I can't even believe that just happened. I knew Agnes Crumplebottom was gonna try us. Who's the baby daddy? I'm pretty sure it's the Grim Reaper, but he is nowhere to be found. Like, he lingered around our house for so long. And then, um... And then, now he's just gone. I'm about to see if I can check if our listings are... Um, check house listings. Uh, she has not provided us with any house listings yet. She's taking forever. Not her grabbing the drink. Oh, it says, don't come near me, you violent scum. <gasps> don't talk to Doris like that. She's not even violent like that. Agnes hit us first. Now, hold on. I don't want to, uh... Options... Fame and reputation. Okay, we don't want her to get a bad reputation or something. So, anyways. <gasps> her baby shower starts in one hour? Hold on, I forgot that she was having her baby shower today. Hold on, we need to go into MC Command Center right now and pick out her baby shower outfit. Because ain't no way... Thank you, Alien K. That's so sweet. Um, ain't no way we are about to go to our baby shower looking like this. So, first, I'm gonna make a cold weather version of what we're gonna wear, just in case, because we need something cute either way. Um, I guess for her cold weather outfit, we'll just do... This is not that cute. This is not that cute at all, but we have that. Anyways, for her party wear... We need something baby shower-esque for Doris. I like the back on this. Thank you, Lily. I like the back on uh, this. Sorry, I just had to block somebody. Anyways. <laughs> Anyways. um, We're going to go ahead... This is a wedding dress. Isn't this what, uh, Farquette or somebody wore to their wedding? Not Farquette. What was that girl's name? I don't even know. But we need- Ooh, this actually looks very, uh, very baby shower-y. Now, she's having twins. She's having one boy and one girl, so we don't really need to stick to, like, a color or anything. Um... Do you think Grim will show up for the birth? No, I think the Muffin Man's gonna be there. Truthfully. Oh, this is cute, too. Actually, this is, like, very flattering on her. Let's get these tights off. And then let's do... Some little... On oh, the back has a little bow. Doris, you look so adorable. That is so cute. I'm gonna put a little necklace on her. Are we having the babies tonight? Hopefully. If not, it'll be in tomorrow's episode. Posted to TikTok. Um. That's not cute. I just want, like, a little, like, a little dainty necklace, perhaps, that will match. That doesn't really match anything that we're wearing. Um, okay, maybe we won't be doing a necklace, because I hate everything she's trying on right now. Okay, we'll do that little heart one, I guess. Anyways, so now we have a little outfit set up for the baby shower. 
the brooch looked hella cute. Stephanie said, dude, you are my favorite. Thank you. Y'all, how many likes is the live at? I can't see it personally. I do get curious from time to time. Um, so hopefully her reputation isn't terrible now. But she's looking at her little baby bump with her two babies in there. Um, can we go ahead and go to the event or is it going to pop up later? Uh, not Granny in here. Granny Lucas in here busting a move. 20,000. Thank you guys for 20,000 uh, likes or almost 20,000 likes. So, oop, I thought you said viewers. I can see the amount of viewers. Um, she had to go potty. I kind of want to cook some cupcakes really quick. before. Actually, we don't have time to cook those cupcakes. It's about to be her baby shower right now. Also, what happened to the Muffin Man? Did he just leave? He stays leaving. I don't like that. She's so pretty. Wow, she's pretty. Anyways, um... I guess Doris didn't listen and she decided that she was still going to make these damn cupcakes. You can't tell a pregnant woman not to go make cupcakes when you got this huge ass cupcake machine right here. Leave that man and go for her. Honestly, she's going to a baby shower without him. He's not invited anyways. Ooh, she made these cupcakes just in time for her baby shower. We'll bring them with us. I'm a, I thought Granny Wolf was murdered by Doris. She was. She was. Granny Wolf isn't here. She's in a... Oh, let's start. Granny Wolf is in a, um... A tomb in our front yard right now. How Spark Plug get with that pretty girl? Spark Plug has a thing going on with Anna right now. We cannot risk messing that up right now. So, here we are for the... Oh, uh, not the glitch not the glitch anyways this is the little community center i've actually never been here before cute i guess um i guess we're gonna set out some cupcakes right we can't set them on these tables what the hell this community center sucks i guess we'll set the cupcakes out over here and we will call to meal and then Thank you for the Minecrafts. Um, so far we have a few people in here. Look at Snow White. Snow White always slays. Girl, the body is bodying. And then Doris is the last one to come in. She's kind of waddling, so you know how it is. Why is everybody coming up here? Oh, because of the freaking the computers? Of course they are. I've actually never done the whole baby shower thing in here so i'm not exactly sure how it's even supposed to work this is kind of more of an experiment for me today but we'll share the big news with snow white which obviously oh anna you look so pretty look at anna not in her stripper clothes now rapunzel i cannot say so much for but um who knocked doris up i'm pretty sure it was the grim reaper i'm pretty sure it was the grim reaper not a thousand percent sure everybody's grabbing their little cupcakes now and then um oh they can guess the new baby's future career oh rapunzel this is a family event um ew let's gush about the new baby um <laughs> not the muffin man just texted her and said i heard that um you and agnes are enemies how do you fix your needs i have a mc command center or not mc command center ui cheats and that's how you can like just click to fix their needs not shrekunzel in her christmas outfit for the day i guess we're up here telling snow white about um everything but i feel like we're supposed to be talking about the baby and why did nobody bring her a present the hell nobody brought her a present nobody has shit to say like nobody's feeling her bump this is the worst baby shower ever y'all are not going hard enough for doris right now girl don't ugh, just eat your cupcake don't even be mad at them right now 
Just eat your, uh, cupcake. You might need to block someone in here. I did, uh, I did block that person already. But don't report them because then it'll just, like, report the <laughs> stream probably. But I did block them. Anyways... Let's see. Invite to feel baby. Shrekira's actually her granddaughter, if you think about it. I feel like we should try to hook her up with somebody. Let's, um... She already knows that we're pregnant, but I guess we'll share the news again. And then friendly. More. Uh, I thought we could, like, help her find somebody. I thought there was, like, an action for that friendly gossip okay other sims let's tell her she should hook up with um if we can't have jack sparrow shakira should thank you christina for the tiktoks oh no rapunzel no i don't know where rapunzel is i just know that she was not wearing what she's supposed to why is she falling to her knees? She's glitching because I aged them up too fast. It says, Jack sounds like a catch. I'll introduce myself when I see him. Okay. All right. My sim turned wolf and destroyed her bathroom because I was watching yours. Listen, that sounds like Granny Wolf. She tore up the entire club. Anna's up here. Apparently she hasn't, Doris hasn't actually introduced herself to Anna. Let's share the big news with her too. And then, let's go ahead and, there's like not that many things that you can really do at the baby shower, to be honest. Weird. Is, um, do they have our listings ready yet? Check house listings. No, she still doesn't have them listed. Oh! <gasps> Of course, Spark Plug comes up here because her girl is up here. Oh, and she actually brought us a present. Spark Plug is the best. Spark Plug is literally the best. It says a baby shower gift has been placed in your inventory. Thank you. That is too sweet of you, Spark Plug. Let's, um. Can we, like, tell her thank you? Let's gush about the new baby, I guess. And, I don't know, I guess we can't say, like, thank you for the present. Thank you for being the only one who brought a present. Of course, um, do y'all remember Nyla Boone? That Doris is apparently long-lost relative. She came today. Lord. We love Sparkplug. She's probably Doris's favorite niece. No, literally. Sparkplug's the only one who showed up with a present. What the frick? All right, let's go ahead and head back to the swamp. Um, I'm ending that. And then also the baby shower. I think it's already about to end anyways. Let's see if it just ends by itself. Oh, no, 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 it was just glitching. Okay, we'll go ahead and end the baby shower. How is Sparkplug alive? Because she made a wish as a ghost in the wishing well and got brought back to life on Christmas. Welcome back, Sparkplug. Anyways, let's go ahead and head back to the swamp. Um, it is 10.34 p.m., so we're going to get Doris to go to bed, and hopefully in the morning, hopefully in the morning, she um, has some listings so we can go check out some houses um, and maybe even get into a new house before she has her baby. Yeah, it was a Christmas miracle. And what was the Muffin Man's reaction to the baby? So she asked the Muffin Man if he'll be there for the birth. And he said yes. So I guess he assumes it's his baby. Don't forget Miko. Oh my god, I don't even know where Miko is. Let's see, do we know Miko by chance? She probably doesn't. She probably doesn't even know Miko. I don't know how the hell we're gonna find Miko. Hopefully we just- <gasps> The fairy godmother died?! Aw, Fairy Godmother passed away recently. Damn. I'm 
everyone's starting to question the realtor's star rating. To be fair, she said it would be ready tomorrow. Um, I'm just kind of, like, rushing her. But let's have everybody go to sleep for the evening. Um... Don't mind me putting my phone on Do Not Disturb. Shrek Hunzel, would you like to go to sleep? No. I just have a feeling she's about to glitch, so I'm resetting her. Anyways, let's go to sleep. Everybody go Betty Bye, please. And then in the morning, hopefully we have some... Oh, it says she can't get in here. Why? Why can't you get in the bed? What's blocking it? Usually they can get in the bed. I don't know what's blocking that. I'll have to deal with that later. Anyways, I guess um, you're just going to sleep elsewhere. I don't know what to tell you, Shrekunzel. I guess uh, don't sleep then, if that's what you want to do. Anyways, and it's snowing outside right now. Also, for those of y'all asking how Sparkplug came back to life, this is the wishing well. So whenever the Sims make a wish, they can uh, wish for a promotion, they can wish for happiness, romance, simoleons, skills, a child, or to be younger. So the well can either grant your wish or they can uh, make what you're wishing for worse. So that's the only risky part um, about using the wishing well. Tosha said, I got my husband hooked on your series. That's so funny. The comments, like, people saying that their husbands watch, too. I love that. Have Shrekunzel wish for a baby. <gasps> that would be so cute. But Shrekunzel's engaged right now. So we gotta let her have her wedding later and try for a baby first. Because she hasn't technically tried for a baby yet. So we won't rush anything. I'm gonna skip ahead to 8 a.m. So let's go ahead and check and see if we have any listings yet. Because good lord. Um, it says realtors work hours are from 6 a.m. to 11 p.m. Um, it is 6 a.m. to 11 p.m. It's 8 a.m. girl. Get it together. I probably just messed up the whole thing skipping forward in time like that. Have Sparkplug wish for a baby? So with Sparkplug, I think if she, whenever it's time for her to have a baby, you can actually have a science baby. I don't know if y'all can read it, but it ha says it down here. Have science baby as a single parent. So I think that's the route we'll go for with a uh, Sparkplug. So not Donkey licking up the puddle in the bathroom. Donkey, you don't even know what that is. You nasty, nasty boy. Ew. Anyways, um, let's see if this has fixed itself yet. Okay, yeah, let's check the house listings. Oh my goodness. Girl, I'm starting to doubt Shayna, because why the hell don't we have any, um, why don't we have any house listings yet? Like, we've been waiting for forever. And also, Doris is only getting bigger by the Who's this ghost calling us? It says, hi, Doris. This is the doctor's office. I know waiting for the, for the results must have been stressful, but I'm happy to tell you that your pap smear came back normal. You can breathe a sigh of relief now. Um, thank you, Miss Dead Lady, for calling and letting us know um, that our pap smear was normal. At least the doctor's office. It Who's this calling? This other dead lady called us and said, Hey Doris, hope you're doing well. Just want to let you know that we got your blood results back. And it looks like you have an RH negative pregnancy. No need to worry though. We've got everything under control. You can come in quick for an easy injection to ensure a smooth pregnancy. What? Oh, hell. <sighs> Doris. Apparently, we're having some pregnancy complication, y'all. So, we're going to have to go get a shot really quick. And who's calling now? Shayna said, greetings, Miss Shrek. I'm happy to announce I finally found some great houses. Great. Glad we can check that out after we go get our, um... I guess we're not going to go get that shot. 
the thing went away. So, you know what? Whatever. I'm moving on to the houses, and hopefully the pregnancy thing is fine. Let's go ahead and check the house listings. Mr. Gold's house? No, we are not buying his house. That house is occupied, okay? Um... I don't know which houses we would be interested in. Ooh, Lilo and Stitch House. We're not going to take over Rapunzel's Tower. Um, we're not taking Regina's house either. What's up here? We have that one and we have i don't know we'll check out the lilo and stitch house in that other cottage i guess i don't know we'll check out those two first and we can go ahead and do a home tour now so let's go ahead and start our home tours i guess before she pops this uh baby out Get the shot, she needs it. Oh lord. Oh lord, everybody's worried about the shot. We'll- we'll go get the shot after our, um, after we look at some houses first. Not everybody in the house here. She's talking about, I'll get the door, okay. Somebody asked if we could get an update on the family tree. Let me show the family tree really quick. So, it actually start- <gasps> Who the hell is Jay? We'll have to look at who Jay is momentarily, because I don't know who the hell Jay Swamp is. Anyways, so it started with Lord Farquaad, and Lord Farquaad had Farkley with Doris. And then Farkley had, um, Shrekira with Fiona, and then Fiona died- but anyways, so then Shrekira went and got pregnant by Bajorn, and apparently she also got pregnant by, I guess she just adopted Jay, because it says that she's the only mother, there is no dad to Jay. So I guess Shrekira went and adopted a baby, that is so cute! Um, anyways, so she had twins, she had Farquette, and she had- <gasps> Who is Morgan?! Um, Shrumple is apparently a daddy. Anyways, it went Shrakira to Farquette to Farquifa to Shrumple to who the hell? Okay, Shrumple's been busy while I've been gone. I'm gonna have to address this, the, uh, that storyline tomorrow because who the hell is that? Um, anyways, so let's go ahead and tour these houses really quick before she dies from not getting this shot. Um, this house is ugly. We do not like the- Oh, not an urn on the floor. Who died right here? Oh, there's the fairy godmother's urn. Well, alright. Thank you, Jules, for the, um, rose. We don't like this house. Let's, um, real estate. Let's, uh, continue our home tours. <gasps> Not Captain Hook is here. Huh. And not her crying over here. Girl, get over it. Get over it. We need to move on to our next home tour. I think we're only looking at two houses right this second. He said, you don't look at me, I'll just have a baby. Literally, he got somebody pregnant in the time I have not been over there. Um, no, we are not adding this house to the short list. Thank you for showing me this house, but no thank you. Anyways. Can we continue on to the next one? Make the decision. Um, continue home tours. Yes. We'll continue on. And then after this next house, we are going to go to the, uh, to the doctor and get that shot so nobody's stressed about her or anything. So, this is the Lilo and Stitch house. I guess Lilo and Stitch moved out. Um, this house is on the beach in Sulani. Very cute. There's a waterfall over there. Um, there's a volcano over there. What else? 
I mean, it's really just an island paradise. Um, inside the house looks honestly pretty freaking cute. Wow, this is adorable. This is really cute. I could see Doris raising a baby. Oh, it's Lilo's room. Now, Lilo, why did you leave your room this messy when y'all are trying to sell the house? But it says, this classic deserted islet formed the natural accumulation of sand shored up by the surrounding reefs. It happens to make the perfect untouched beach. So it's on its own little beach. Um... Lilo's room is killing me because why did she leave her room so messy like this? Uh, yeah, this is that little hallway. Remember when Lilo was like screaming down the stairs? Or from her, um. <gasps> Shrek Kira said, Why didn't you tell me he was already in a relationship? Who's Captain Hook with? Hold on. I had to see. It says spouse none. So who's he dating? I've got to find out who he is with. Because why did she just say that he's already in a relationship? It, are they talking about us? Are they talking about how we have a romantic interest in him? I really hope she's not talking about us. Um, anyways, our realtor is looking very cute today. So we are going to, let's, um ask about the appraised value on this home house is a no for doris are you live on twitch right now not right this second it says after careful evaluation it's been found to be valued at 185k simoleons um okay it has two bedrooms two baths it's in sulani okay Good to know. Alright, this was cute and all, but we actually have to go to the, um, we'll add it to our short list for now, and we'll keep touring other homes. Uh, we'll go ahead and go home, and then we're gonna go to our a doctor's appointment to get that shot. Nah, Norris needs, not Norris, <laughs> Doris needs something different. I agree, I imagine her in more of like a cottage, you know? Um, something like very fantasy, whatever. I do like that house and it's cute. I'll keep it in mind, but I think she's definitely going to need to look more before we purchase a whole home. Um, but for now, let's go ahead and go and get that shot really quick. Oh, don't terminate the pregnancy, Lord. Um, what am I looking for? We need to call the, what was that? chatty family call no we're not doing no chatty family call right this second we need to call the ob we also need to pick out how we're going to be having this baby she's like talking to everybody shrek you literally never have no clothes on literally never literally never do you watch once upon a time i've actually not finished it at all but i have just started uh start watching it again it says get the injection so yeah let's go ahead and go and get it it says getting the injection uh offers essential protection and it says a bunch of other stuff about it so let's go let's try to bring the muffin man see if he'll go with us to get this little shot your computer loads stuff super quick is it a is it a laptop or a desktop this is a, I'm playing on a gaming computer. Now, I will say it is not necessary to play on a gaming computer because I used to play on my MacBook for a long time. And before that, I played on some shitty little computer. I don't even know what it was called. Um, how do we get the shot? Get blood work? No. Cap? No. I don't know how we get the shot. I'm not, oh, we need, we're gonna ask Mohawk Doctor. He'll get us squared away for sure. She's a higher risk pregnancy. Uh, does that mean that we shouldn't, um, that we shouldn't, um, do a home birth? Because I was kind of wanting to do another home birth, but if y'all think she's going to be high risk anyways, if she's having to get this shot, then maybe we shouldn't, um, then maybe we shouldn't.
hospital birth, C-section, home birth. She'll be good after the shot. It says, you did great with the injection. If you have any concerns or any assistance down the road, don't hesitate to get in touch. So I feel like we're fine. Um... Normally need that shot at the beginning and the end of the pregnancy. Well, she's in, the, like, the middle of her pregnancy right now. She's in her second trimester. She'll be in the third trimester in a few hours. While we're here, let's go ahead and get a ultrasound. Since she is having twins and has already had to have that shot thing, let's go ahead and get an ultrasound while we're here. Just make sure everything's still looking good. Is she still listed as a young adult? Yes, for the next four days she's still uh she's still a young adult no i miss so much will you please put this on youtube yes it'll be at be on youtube probably like tomorrow wasn't granny supposed to have babies granny's babies are still on the way actually her her babies might already be born i just don't know where the hell her baby mama is we gotta find her at some point but yeah Granny got a girl, Miko, pregnant with twins. So, Granny's babies are somewhere. I don't know if they've been born yet, but she definitely got her pregnant. What mods are you using? I use... I kind of rotate out different ones, but the main ones I use are MC Command Center, UI Cheats, the Realistic Birth Mod by Panda Sama. Thank you for the duck! That was so cute! <laughs> I've never seen the duck. Um... It's just, he's talking about the twins again. But yeah, I use a realistic birth mod by Panda Sama, UI Cheats, uh, the base mental drugs, uh, the extreme violence A mod. And we are having a girl and a boy. Thank you for the roses. She usually lives in San Mishuna, but she might have moved by now. True. Um, also, random thing. If anybody is interested in becoming a mod for my streams, please DM me on Instagram. I have a couple mods right now, like my sister and everything, but they're not always available every single time I stream. So, anyways, thank you for the melon, Sam. Who, yeah, I have Wicked Whims, too. Oh my god, he didn't come again. You're right. The Muffin Man did not show up again. And he's supposed to be there for the birth. And he once again did not freaking show up. What the hell? What the hell? You know what? Whatever. Also, we need to decide if she's going to be having this baby at home or if she's going to be having the baby at the hospital. Because she can use the little ogre room. Which I think that'd be so cute. She used a little ogre room. So precious. Grim would have shown. Yeah, um... I don't know where the hell Grim is, to be honest. I see him in our thing. Him and Father Winter. Everyone say the hospital. Okay, we'll go ahead and schedule for her to have a natural birth in the hospital. Hopefully... We don't have to have a C-section, but if she does have to have a C-section, it's fine. Does anybody remember how she had Barkley? I know that episode was quite a while ago because I don't remember um, how she delivered before, but this will be her, these twins will be her second delivery. Um, hmm. Father Winter needs to be the dad. She has not done nothing with Father Winter. So let's go ahead and go back home. Also, we need to age up Snow shit again. Right now, she's like a little child. Thank you, Harry Toes. Do, do, do. So we're going back home. Let me look at the calendar and see what all's going on. Tomorrow in the game is when she's supposed to be having her baby. And then Shrek's birthday is on Sunday. Interesting. Very interesting. Zoom, 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 zoom. I love this. Um, if anybody else changes their loading screen, I got this one on the same website that you download the Extreme Violence mod. They have it listed under their like um, their different thing, their different loading screens. So freaking cute. Love it. Thank you, Shay, for the finger heart. 
No wonder he stays in his birthday suit. No, for real. Donkey, you're actually outside for once. Donkey, you are so cute. Um, I'm gonna get... Can baby Snowshit come over here and wish for anything? Let's see. Make a wish. She can't wish to be older. Hmm. I guess we're just gonna make her a cake. So let's go ahead and turn her into a teenager while we're here today. Let's go ahead and cook and do a chocolate cake. What happened to breeding out the Squidward? I still have not been able to make Squidward exactly the way I want him yet. That is still going to be a thing. We are going to breed out the Squidward once I make him correctly. And I've looked on the gallery too. I've been like trying to see if anybody else has made him really good. And I still, we just don't have him down yet. So once I create him perfectly or the best I really can, have the time to like spend like two hours trying to make Squidward in his big ass head in his big ass nose then we'll have breed out squidward make the mom sandy you know what i feel like they would have a very solid traditional values as marriage imagine she's trying to take care of the new baby at night and then he's over there playing that damn clarinet i know squidward would be so annoying to have as a spouse do 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 would be challenging no literally literally is going to be so challenging okay let's go ahead and have this little mini birthday party again for um snow shit she's slowly aging up doris did you just break that damn sink again <sighs> lord well doris you know what happens you're the one that breaks it you need to fix it Where do the stairs go? They just go to the top of the house. You can't actually really get up there. Oh, okay. Let's pick out her traits. I think she's going to be... We will make her a party animal. And she wants to be popular. <gasps> Snow shit is a teenager. Now she only needs one more time aging up. And she will be uh, a freaking young adult again. God bless it. She said, and I'm eating a piece of my cake. Damn it. Also, if any of you have time, check out my YouTube in the link in my bio. It's where I upload these streams later. Um, trying to get to 2,000 followers. So, Jade said, what am I doing wrong? Oh my god, if you asked a question earlier, I did not see it. I'm so sorry. Snow shit should have a baby next. Hopefully, I really want to set her up with Mohawk Doctor. I feel like, um, they'd be so cute. You said you can't use the birth pool at all. When you place it, it just disappears unless you log out and go back. I do not know. I would uninstall the mod and try re-downloading it. Um, she looks so cute as a teenager, too. Snow shit, you're so cute. So freaking adorable. Name the baby not shit. Well, she's not pregnant right now, but I am so excited for all of them to have, like, their little babies. Doris has still not found a house, and she's supposed to be having, um, her baby tomorrow. Okay, you guys, I'm gonna be going ahead and ending the live here, because we have been here for over an hour now. Um, but tomorrow in tomorrow's TikTok post, Doris will be having her baby so if anybody has any um suggestions for baby names let me know really quick before i get off but did we decide on doris's baby name? no but yeah she's having one boy one girl dorito oh my goodness the muffin man is outside the house <gasps> he is outside the house i hope he doesn't have any other kids or anything <gasps> you guys he has a spouse. No. No. <gasps> Wait. Her boyfriend, Doris's boyfriend, has, is married. Wasn't that Fart Pond's baby mama? 
Is that not Bart Pond's baby mama? <gasps> oh no! Oh nay nay! And she was married to the Muffin Man! <laughs> oh no! Also, thank you, Forrest, for the rose, but oh my god! Fart Pond's son, that's his stepdad, is the Muffin Man, and Doris is dating the Muffin Man, and he's married to Fart Pond's baby mom. Oh my god. That, yeah, that's why he was freaking out. Not because she's pregnant, because he thinks that those babies are his, and he is already married to Fart Pond's baby mama. Oh. Don't break up. No. What a turn of events. Okay, y'all. Well, stay tuned for the new episode coming out tomorrow night at 8 p.m. <laughs> I will see you guys tomorrow. Thank you for watching. And this stream will be uh, re-uploaded to YouTube tomorrow if you'd like to watch the whole thing start to finish.